Good morning, everyone, and welcome back to Mossley Farm. And today is a very special day because it is the Flower Festival, the Year Two Flower Festival. So we are going to be heading over to the Flower Festival in just a little bit. I kind of need to tidy up the farm, even though I'm missing my scythe and my axe. It's driving me up a wall to be missing those things. And we are going to be dancing with our new fiance. So we are going to be dancing with Leia. We proposed to her. She is going to be our fiance. We are getting married in two more days. It's going to be amazing. I have a lot. Of tidying up of my my farm, I definitely should be doing. Oh gosh! Oh, and I should probably check just to see if there's anything on TV today. Let's see. And it's gonna be a beautiful sunny day tomorrow. And anything here? Complete breakfast. Yeah, we already know how to make that. And fortune teller. The spirits are in good humor today. I think you'll have a little extra luck. Wonderful! So the fortune teller seems to think that we'll have a great day for the flower festival, which I'm really looking forward to. All right, let's go ahead. We've actually been making a ton of money because I've been, well, uh, not a ton, a ton, but we've been making quite a bit. Look at our little boy chicken. It's so cute. Meteor, how are you doing? All right. And how are you doing, Zinya? Doing good. It looks like Marigold is doing good. Rosestone looks like she's doing good. All right. And we'll gather up these and we'll gather up this. There we go. All right. There's a little parsnip over here. So yeah, it's been kind of a very chaotically almost messy. Back you go. I wish I had the scythe so we were collecting the hay in that, but we're not. It's been kind of a chaotically messy um, couple of days because I was so distracted trying to pick someone to marry. I was really all over the place with it. All right, the grass needs to just back up just a teensy bit. That's too much. I took away too much of the grass. There we go. I just wanted to take away a teensy bit so I can see what's going on. So yeah, a very chaotic couple of days as we figured out which one of our many, many girlfriends and boyfriends we were going to pick to marry. And in the end, I did pick Leia because I think that she's the one who would really love to see the farm thrive on a plant and animal based level just as much as I want it to. All right, we're gonna come in here. We'll get some mayonnaise going, collect that little duck egg. I think there's some special things with duck mayonnaise I'm supposed to be doing. I Did we already do the duck mayonnaise thing? We may have already done the duck mayonnaise thing, but I can't remember if we did the duck mayonnaise thing or not. So I'll make some duck mayonnaise just in case. I think some of the villagers really love it as a present anyway. And let's see, we also need to get the, the bunnies pretty soon. So we'll work on getting some bunnies soon. Oh, look at that. All right, we'll come over and grab this blackberry. Thank you, fruit bats. They've been really diligent about giving lots and lots of fruit lately. All right, and I don't have any, yeah, I do have some coal on me. So you know what, let's go ahead. Let's actually get some of the, the refined quartz. Yeah, it looks like I'm totally out of refined quartz, actually. Let's get some quartz cooking. Let's get some gold cooking. Wanna make sure we do lots of work. See, I'm getting back into the flow of everything, all of our daily chores. Now that I'm not like tripping over myself with nerves because we're going to get married. Oh, all right. And we're going to come down. Let's check inside the greenhouse. We've got this. Greenhouse looks like it's doing great. And we've got lots of tomatoes. Wonderful. All right. I think the tomatoes are actually a big part of making those um, salads that Leia loves. So that's going to be really important because she was talking about all of the delicious food that you could make for somebody if you worked on or like if you lived on a farm. And of course, we'll make her some delicious food. Peapot, how are you doing? Bluebell, how are you doing? Oh, the flower for dance has begun in the forest. Okay, okay, okay. We're gonna go, we're gonna go like in just half a second here. I wanna go dance with my fiance. Um, okay, anything, I, I'm just gonna leave this here. And we're gonna milk the cow and the goat really quickly. And just really, really quickly. All right, ladies, anything today? All right, excuse me, come on. All right, are you, there. <laughs> Sometimes they're so stubborn about it. All right, man, I need to clear out some of these little trees. Hey, what do you, what, 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 no, sweetie, stop moving. There we go. All right, there's some milk, and I do need to get more goats, actually. So milkweed, I do need to get more goats because Leia does love the goat's milk. All right, come over here, and let's come up here, make some cheese and some goat's milk. There we go, there we go. And we can put these things away. Wonderful. So let's go ahead and grab this fruit off the fruit tree. And then we're going to head on the back of Rose Stone. And we are going to get down. Do, 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 do. Fruit, fruit, fruit. We'll just store the fruit in here. I guess that we could actually have a chest inside the barn because it's right next to a bunch of our little fruit trees we're planting. That could just be kind of used as a fruit storage cellar. Look at the little void chicken. It's so cute. It's so cute. All right, and Rose Stone, I need help getting there fast enough. I'm so slow through the grass. All right, 
And we do need to build a path that goes down through this direction so that we're able to get to the forest a little bit quicker too. But I do need to get my scythe and my axe back to do that. Oh gosh, okay. Wow, I forgot that it just popped you right over here. All right, let's go dance with Leia. Oh, I wish I could clean that up because I am hoping this is going to be awesome. Also, I can't wait for the update. I know I keep mentioning it, but you guys, I'm so excited for the update that we should hopefully have pretty soon for Stardew Valley. So I'm going to try not to get too far ahead of myself so that we'll be able to celebrate the update together. That should be really fun. And let's see what Pierre has to sell today. The tub of flour recipe. Are you kidding me? Of course, I'm going to buy that. Now we can make the tub of flowers, you guys. Yes. And we're going to buy the rare crow. Yes, the one that I really really wanted so we now have the flower festival rare crow and I'm gonna buy another tub of flowers I'll constrain myself to only buying one every year from the flower festival I can make my own now I wonder is there anything let's see crafting let's see and there it is oh wow okay actually we can pull that off pretty easily with our um with our greenhouse, we'll be able to get the tulip bulb, the jazz seeds, the poppy seeds, and the spangle seeds and put them all together and make a tub of flowers. Oh, we can decorate flowers all over the place. That would be so fun. Oh my goodness. I wish there were more recipes so that I could make more plant things I could just sprinkle all over my house. All right, let's talk to Leia first things first. Oh my gosh, how fun. Yes. We'll ask her to be our dance partner. Oh wait, I can't choose either or. Okay, ask to, to be dance partner. I really hope she's going to dance with us. We're getting married in a couple days. You want to be my partner for the flower dance? Okay, I'd love to. I would hope so, Leia. Oh gosh. Otherwise, things could get really interesting. There's Elliot. And you guys may notice, Elliot looks different now. I found an absolutely amazing retexture of him on Tumblr for people who are big fans of Elliot. And they like to have the idea that Elliot is like part merman. And I don't know if I'm going to go with that, but I'm going to go with the fact that he's decided to embrace living at the sea. So he now decorates his hair with seashells. He has seaweed popping off all over the place. He has little starfish that cling to him. And I just really love the idea that after we broke his heart, he found solace in the sea and the sea is his new love and inspiring him to write all of these like tragic romances and he's kind of taken on this tragically romantic figure of wearing everything so silly like this but he loves seashells and everything now because he will use them to decorate his person i thought that was pretty cool i wore my best shirt for the dance this sort of thing doesn't happen very often and as you can see his shirt now has starfish all over it which is adorable all right i wish pierre would spend this time with family sorry carolyn Ooh, I'm stuffed. Have you tried the red jelly yet? I wonder if Emily would dance with me. Come on, Clint. I really wish that there were more things you could do to like encourage the relationships as the years go by and have like your rivals get married and they have kids too. That would be really, really fun. I think the kids are supposed to start doing things in the new update, like just a couple little things. You can have kids. Don't worry. A lot of people were against me marrying like another girl because they're like, you can't have kids. Yes, you can. You guys, we can adopt kids. That'll, that'll come. And honestly, I could see Leia being really excited about that, but I could see Abby maybe not being so okay with that. So, all right, let's go ahead. Ah, the air smells so sweet with all these flowers. Open fields, it makes me nervous. Oh, Kent, can I, can, I can't really give him a present right now, I don't think. Are you going to be dancing today, Siri? Oh, you bet, Jody. I have some exciting news. Maybe we'll announce it to everybody at the end of the dance. The springtime dances can be traced back to an ancient fertility ritual. Oh, Demetrius. Oh gosh, kids. Someday I'm going to be the flower queen. That's not fair. Why can't I be the flower queen? Oh, Vincent, that's adorable. You could be the flower queen if you want. Penny? I'm nervous. Oh, Penny. I'm working up the courage to ask someone to dance with me. Mm, Harvey, whom would you get along well with? He really loves... How about Pam? You love drinking. She loves drinking. There you go. I mean, you gave me beer for Christmas, Harvey. Honestly. Oh, hello there. It's nice of you to talk to me. Oh, spring is almost over. What a shame. Hang in there, Linus. I know I haven't visited you for a while. I'm sorry. I'll explain. And I love Maru's hair still. I like dancing, but this one is a little stilted. The old timers really love it, though. All right. And then... Marnie looks lovely today. Oh... Marnie, love is in the air, and I'm still single. Marnie, I, I don't know, you and the mayor, you and apparently the sky. Mm, Marnie's very popular. All right, Haley, practicing? I'm practicing my dance moves. It needs to be perfect. All right, and how are you doing over here? I'm just enjoying the scenery, Alex. 
honestly. All right, Mayor, I'll talk to you in just a second. Flowers? I can hardly see them. Aw, George, do you want some? Do you want some eggs and leeks? I wish I could bring him more gifts. I've been working on these floral arrangements for a week. Do you like them? Of course, Evelyn. That's so sweet. And Abby. Oh, this is a little awkward, but Abby? I really hate dancing in front of everyone. It's so embarrassing. You know, I think Abby is going to bounce back from us marrying someone else really well because she's going to move on and find adventures and we'll still go on adventures in the mines together, Abby. I promise. Sebastian? Sebastian, I, I, I'm sorry. You're, you're like a brother to me. <laughs> Sam, you know what? I admit it. I really like flowers. That's really cool, Sam. Frog season is really starting to pick up. Oh, gosh. Can I catch frogs? I can't remember. I should have brought my fishing pole. Now this is the life, huh, kid? Sweet wine, a babbling brook, warm air. Did I mention the wine? You did. Hey, why don't you go talk to Harvey? I think you two would hit it off. All right. Mm, excellent sauce. All right, so Shane's enjoying that. Let's see. We already talked to everybody over here. All right, I think that's about it. And let's come up and talk to the mayor and get this started. Let's go ahead and start the dance. And this year, I have somebody to dance with. Somebody very, very special to me, too. Am I going to be wearing my little hat? Should I take it off? <gasps> I'm wearing my little outfit and my hat. I want to have a pretty dress. I thought I was going to... I thought there was going to be a pretty dress involved in all of this. Well, <laughs> oh, this, I love that flower crown that Haley has on. I wish I could get that. Look at Leia. Oh, how cute. It's so adorable. Penny and Sam. I don't know if I, I could see that relationship working out. There you go. Very traditional sort of dance. And it's very nice. Just bringing the community closer together. There we go. Time to go home. All right. And now it is evening. Wow. Really, really late in the evening. Oh my gosh. Were the strawberries ready? <laughs> And we're living the farm life where we go from one second of enjoying the customary dances and the festivities and the next second and we're running around collecting honey and frantically like plucking strawberries to ship before the end of the evening. Look at all this honey. So much tulip and blue jazz honey. Oh, I really need to go for the blue jazz honey actually because that sells for a lot more I think. All right, and then I need to go get Rose Stone. I think that she'll pop back over here, actually. She's a good horse about teleporting back. All right, and let's see what we have over here. Let's just sell everything with a star. Because that now, now that we can actually just continually to make things in the greenhouse, and especially because we're kind of getting a little tied up on money. Well, I'm going to keep that because we can actually make some spring seeds with that. But yeah, now that we can make things in the greenhouse, it's not quite as important to hold on and grasp every item uh, for different projects. There we go. And let's go ahead and gather up there. There we go. The bait. Wonderful. Put that on my fishing rod. I'm still really, really, really missing not having my, um, not having my axe, not having my scythe. That's sort of, that's sort of cramping my style if you get me. All right. And is that everything I can do right now? I'm pretty sure. What if we do a little bit more work in the greenhouse? Just real quick. We want to make it the full use of every day as much as we possibly can. There's some tomatoes to add in. Gosh, everything moved around. That, that kind of creeped me out. We can put a potato in there. And we have potatoes from over here. Cauliflower, parsnips. Did I say turnips? Those are parsnips. And then green bean. Um, I think strawberries can go in here. And then there's things like leeks and daffodils that I can put in another chest. So we'll kind of sort everything, make sure it has a place. There we go. I can't believe I'm getting married, like, in a couple days. I feel like I need to clean the farm totally up and take care of everything. Because I'm getting married and everything needs to be tidy and, like, neat. And, oh gosh, and I don't even have half my things. All right. Let's see if we can find a good place for this rare crow. Maybe replace her with one of the rare crows. How about this one? How about we replace her? Hey, you want to get up? Come here. And there we go. All right. And we're going to put this rare crow right there. She's so pretty. There we go. That'll be fun. And now I can add another tub of flowers. Should I just put it? Can I just put it on the deck? <gasps> I can. All right. What about like right here? Can I put it right here? No. Okay. But I can put it right there. What about right here? All right. There we go. In fact, I kind of want to make another tub of flowers or remove this one because it's been so long. And I wonder if I can put my plants. Oh, I can't put it up here. Okay, that's fine. Well, we're going to put it back over here then. There we go. 
And am I already supposed to go to bed? It's been such a short day. Oh gosh, all right. Well, I guess, oh wait, there's the word harvest. <laughs> I'm such a bad farmer. I'm just so distracted with getting married. Oh my goodness gracious, all right. Well, you guys, tomorrow we are going to be running around and we are going to be making sure... Do I have anything else? Can I cook anything? A complete breakfast, pancakes, anything for my future wife before we get married. Survival burger, miner street, roots platter. Let's see, algae soup if I really wanted to gain a little bit of energy as an emergency. There's also a pizza, which I could actually get and give to Sam. So you know what? We're still trying to be friends with Sam. I might make some pizza. We now have salad, which actually is one of the things that um, Leia really loves. And she also loves, let's see if I have it, red plate. That's the complete breakfast right there. Gives great farming boost. Um... Dish of the Sea, Farmer's Lunch. I know she loves stir fry. And I know she loves... Uh, there's another meal that she loves. Oh gosh, and I may not know it yet. So we might just have to rely on giving her tons and tons of goat cheese. We'll have to see. Hmm. Let's see. Sashimi, fried eel, pepper plate cookies spaghetti blueberry oh blueberry tart that sounds delicious oh yeah the cookies i was gonna make cookies for the kids okay i'm gonna make some cookies so i can give them to jazz and vincent as needed um let's see i think vincent should enjoy cookies i mean come on they're cookies so hopefully he'll enjoy those should i put the cauliflower in here i need to get more eggs so we'll move some eggs into the kitchen but i need to go to sleep now and yeah all right so super duper short flower dance but tomorrow we will be working very, very hard on the farm and sprucing it up and preparing for married life. So I'm very excited, you guys. We're going to get married on Friday. Oh, goodness. All right. So I'll see you guys next time. Bye-bye.